Challenge. Each bottle has a different amount of ten thousand dollars in it. Watch out. Ooh. Watch out for what? Maybe know. the sodas are like woo woo woo. Okay, well, let's see what supplies. Oh, yep, the supplies are in this one because it's heavy. Watch out. Whoa, whoa, yeah, yeah. Okay. Grab it, grab it, grab it. Grab it. Sorry. Oh, it is heavy. Yeah. Let's open it up. Let's see what materials we have inside. Oh yeah. Okay. There's bottles with different amount of money on it. Oh cool. Whoa. But cool, and then there's a pump, so we attach this and let the bottles go flying. Oh, we've done this before. This is gonna be so cool. Yeah, okay, well, let's head to the back. Let's get this challenge started because I want to win some money. You ready, guys? Yep. Count me down. Here we go. Ready, John? Uh -huh. Yep. Three, two, one, start pumping. Okay, here we go. What's gonna happen? I don't think this is working, Grace. Uh, I think it is. The money is too strong. Oh, 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 oh. You almost got it in the hoop. Okay, we'll see how much money is on it. That now scared me. Off. Okay, so let's see how much money I won. Let's see. I got, whoa, it kind of looks like a lot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I got $800. Oh, okay. Oh, that's okay. awesome. Grace wins, but now I'm gonna go and I'm gonna choose one that's gonna have more than 800. So I'm gonna look for one that has a thick stack, like this green one matches with my pants. And uh, do I get to go? Well, Steven, you need a competitor. Two people go at once. Whoever gets the highest rocket wins both of the amount of money on each rocket. Well, I picked a big stack of change, so hopefully I go the highest. So uh, who wants to go against me? I guess I will. I want to win some money. Let me pick my bottle. Ooh, pink was my favorite color, and it did me good. So I think I'm going to do blue, because it's my second favorite color. Okay, John, count us down. Ready? Uh-huh. Three, two, one, start pumping. I get to collect this money from this one and this money from Grace's. Okay. And let's see how much is total. Plus I get the 800 from Grace's last time. Get ready for the final reveal. Okay. Let's see, let's see. Put it all together. That looks like a lot. $2,500. No way. What? Plus Grace's 800. Plus Grace's 800. Let me go get oh, that 800. Oh yeah. Here's my 800. $3,300 shares. I am currently in the lead. Winner goes against John. Yeah. You ready, John? Yeah, I'm very ready. I need some money. I'm gonna knock Steven out of the lead. Okay, well I am loaded up, John. How are you doing? John looks like he's having troubles over there. Let's just put this in. Put that in. Perfect, push it down. All right, get ready to launch. Here we go, Grace. I'm ready for the countdown, you are. Okay, we have yellow and we have orange rockets. Everyone start pumping in three, two, one. Go, 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 go! Whoa, 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 I Box think that's stone. the losing pump. No one use that pump or else you'll lose. Okay, well John, you get all the money. Go ahead and count. Time to find out how Kay. much money I got. You get the money from the orange bottle and the yellow. 1100, 1500, 1600. Okay, that's not bad. 1600 bucks. So Steven's Rocket did not win that round. So John got all the money. With how much money do you have? 1600 bucks. And Steven still's in the lead though. With how much Steven? $3,300. Okay, John. I guess it's me and you All this right. round. So there's still $5,100 left. So really anybody could win this challenge. I'm gonna pick the red, dump out some water, and I'll be good to go. And I am going to pick the purple. Wish me luck, I hope this has a lot of money. Kind of matches my shirt, so I feel like it has some good luck. Let's get started. Since Steven and I both lost on this pump, I'm not using that one. I can't stand a chance to lose again because I have zero money right now. So I'm gonna try out this brand new pump. Twist this on, perfect. And then put the wire in, push it down. Okay, and then flip it over. My rocket is set and I'm ready to win some money this time. I'm ready as well, line up Grace. We got some money to win. Okay, Steven, count us down. All right, Grace versus John, launching their rockets okay. in three, two, one, go. Who's gonna go higher, who's gonna go higher? Let's see, let's see, any moment, oh! Oh! Whoa! Whoa! 
I Whoa. Got okay, oh, hang on. Oh my goodness. That was very close. Yeah, that was the highest one we've ever done. <laughs> Who do you think won? We're gonna have to replay that in slow mo. That was yeah. so high. Let's roll that clip in slow mo. The end moment. Oh! And after reviewing the slow-mo, since I am the judge, it looks like John's rocket actually went higher. So John, you are the winner. I got 500 bucks in my rocket. That's not that good, but that's still money. And Grace must have the rest of the money. From the purple rocket, there was only 600. Wait, what? I think so. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six. Wait, so then we're missing. Wait, that means there's only 6,000 total. Wait. Wait, did someone take the rest? We're missing $4,000. Yeah, because your that's amount weird. plus John's amount doesn't add up to 10,000. That only adds up to 6,000, right? Because you had 3,300. Yeah. We're missing money. How did that happen? Hold on. Maybe some of the money fell off when the rockets went in the sky or something. I feel like we would have seen it, right? Yeah. Oh, oh wait, guys. <laughs> oh, that's round. There's the rest uh, of the money. Oh, and miniature bottles, too. Yeah, yeah we these forgot could to go, lay these ones out. These could go higher. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so since it's my channel and I have no money. This round, the bonus round, will be me against Steven. Oh. Winner takes all. Good luck. Okay, winner takes all. That's fine, Grace. I'll bet all of my $3,300 against all of this money in this round. And uh, which one do you want, blue or green? I'll do green to match my awesome pants. Grace, you take blue. Perfect, blue's my favorite color. Let's head over to the pump. All right, this round is the bonus round. I'm giving up my $3,300 plus the $4,000 you can win here for a total of $7,300. Okay. Winner will take all and win this epic soda challenge. Okay, shares, come right now who you think's gonna win, hashtag Steven. Or hashtag Grace, come on, come on. John? Count us down. I'm backing up. Ready? Three, two, two one, go. go. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Ah. Woo! Go, ah. go Grace. Oh, my okay. All right, go, Grace. Okay, go, go, go. Ah. Woo! That money back. <laughs> Where did the rest of that money go? Let me go look for mine. I think mine went out of the fence. Oh no. That the was most so high. Question is, How much money is on there? This money left. Wait, Grace. <laughs> you might never get your money back if we can't find the rocket. Did mine go higher? I have no idea. Hold on, let's go look for it real quick. Where's the rocket? If we can't find it, Grace, you don't get the money. Oh no, we might have lost the money. Open up the gate. Let's see where this is. I can't believe it went over the fence. That's so funny. Way, right? uh, I think we were playing down this way though, right? Yeah, it was over here, it Steven. Down here in those trees, right? I thought so. It looked like uh, it went all the way up there and maybe got stuck. It stuck in the hedges up yeah, here. Yeah, because those are really thick. If it's up there, there's no way we're getting oh, it back. No, oh no. And then the money's lost forever. Oh no. Okay. I don't see it. I don't see any signs of it. What color was it? It was green, right? Green, yeah. Green. I think it's just going to blend in. That's green. There's hmm. no way. Well, uh... How are we supposed to get the money? We might have to open up another box and do another <laughs> challenge. Wait, my rocket went the highest, so that's my money that I'm losing? No, I'm pretty sure mine went the highest. No, mine did, right, John? I don't know. Today, we are going to do the most extreme challenge ever. We will be testing out TikTok candies. So for today's challenge, we have our mystery wheel, and the mystery wheel picks which TikTok candy we get to test out. We have scoring cards right here for whoever gets the most satisfying candies wins $10,000. I am so excited because I have such a big sweet tooth. What are we waiting for? Let's get this challenge started since it's my channel. I'll go first. Okay, here we go. In three, two, one, go, 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 go. I hope I get something good. What did I get? Oh, oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, I got one of the sour candies. The sour slime. Oh, okay. There's like strawberry, apple, and cherry. Okay, definitely not cherry. I think I'm gonna do sour apple. And since this is a slime, it's a two in one. I'm gonna make a cool combination. I'm gonna do apple in the roller and blue slime in the squishy one. I've never tried this before. Okay. Ooh. 
It's gooey for sure. Oh my goodness, that is definitely slime. Let's try this. Oh, no. How do you even use this thing? It's not working. Here, I think I have to roll it out. Maybe I lick it. Woohoo! Okay, now that is sour. But it's actually like a really good flavor sour. Oh my goodness. Okay, here we go. Sour slime. For the roller, I have seven. This tastes really, really good. It tastes like something I've had before, but it's a good, nice candy flavor, so it gets a number seven. And then for this sour slime tube, it's extremely sour, but the flavor of the candy is a three. I would not eat this one again, and it's super sticky after you use it. So definitely out of the store. Sarah, now it's your turn to spin the wheel and see which ones you get to try. All right, here I go. Okay, let's see. Touch that, whoa, what are you gonna get? Oh, oh, oh my goodness, the Kinder. These have like toys inside. I wanted to test this one out. All right, let's see what my surprise is. Okay. <gasps> it looks like a car thing. It goes pretty fast. And it kind of looks like the Sharagini. Now let's see what my candy is. Okay. I don't know what that is, but it looks like there's two chocolate candies inside. It looks like little eyeballs or something. Here, let's try. I'll take some without it. Okay. And there's chocolate underneath. Whoa. Here, let's take a bite. How's it taste? It's really sweet. Let's try one of these candies. Yeah, try that crunch Ooh. ball. How's that? That was better. Okay. I think the like, combination of the two is best. The chocolate, it wasn't bad, it, just, it was a lot to take in, and so I think I'm gonna take some points off for the candy, but for the toy, definitely boosted the score up a little bit, so I think I'm gonna give it an eight. Oh, an eight, that beats my score, which means Sarah is in the lead for the $10,000. Hopefully I keep up my scoring and I get good candies, because I really want to win the money. <laughs> yeah, okay, let's head to the mystery wheel and get level two started. Here we go, in three, Two, one, spin something good. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, 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 oh. These look like Frisbees. I've seen them all over like antique stores and I think there's stuff inside. Like listen, look at that. They do not smell like candy. Here we go. Is this even candy? It literally tastes like paper. Oh wait, wait. Okay, now it's starting to get like candy flavored. I think it's like the stuff in the inside. Let's try and pour that out. Mm. Okay, that's like nerd. They're more of like a toy, I think. Like a frisbee than candy. Definitely rating these a zero. There's no flavor. Let's spin the mystery wheel. Okay, let's see what I get. Uh, uh, oh! Not expecting that one. The apple drinks from TikTok that was like trending all over the place. Supposedly, let's... if you bite into it, it sounds like an apple. Let's see. Does it actually work? <gasps> A little bit. Here, try again. Oh my goodness. That one worked. That really worked. So it sounded good. Let's see what it tastes like. How does it taste? That is so sweet. I don't know if I like that very much. I think I'm gonna have to give it a zero. Oh, wait, it, since you gave it a zero, that means we're tied for this round. It's round number three, and let's get a good point. Because when you win this challenge, let's spin the mystery wheel and see what I get. Here we go. Spinning, spinning, spinning. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, we got the jelly fruits. Oh my goodness, check it out. Oh my goodness, this is scary. I feel like it's about to pop everywhere. Maybe try to bite over it so that it doesn't spray everywhere. Okay. <laughs> is this normal? Why is it so hard? This is Can so I hard. Yeah, give it a try. Isn't it really hard? Did you bite it? Oh, you did it, you did it, you did it. How's it taste? It's a cool idea. It's just it's really hard to bite. Okay, let me give it a try. Hopefully this like red one is a better flavor. Mm. Mm. How is it? Wait, these are good. Mm. Mm. Oh my goodness, that flavor. Ooh, this is good. Mm. Yeah, that's will 
really good. Oh, I'm gonna do it today. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. Look at that. It's like actually slime. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's try it. Okay, drum roll, please. And it's a 10. Oh yeah. That's a really good rating. All right, here we go. Let's see, let's see. Oh, oh. An extreme sour spray. Sour apple cherry. And this one is sour blue raspberry. Whoa, that one was good. I think I like this one a lot. Now let's try, maybe try, try green apple next. Okay. It's not spraying. Okay, I think now it is. Oh, I can taste that. This one's better than most apple things, but still not my favorite. This one, I think it tastes like medicine. Here, Grace, you try it. Mm. Whoa! Oh my goodness, that hurts my job. I don't know how you do sour. I don't like sour like this. This is really extreme. I love sour, but I, don't, I think this might be too much for me to have in one sitting. All right, now it's time to rate them. I gave it a nine. And I think it's like, it's really, really sour, but I think the sour is taking over the flavor. So I yeah. think I'd only give it a nine. <laughs> I'd give it. I give it a one because it's way too sour. It's really extreme. So the score is one one. And so I'm so sticky. <laughs> so since it's a tiebreaker round, you gotta get the mystery prize out and see who wins this challenge. Whoever has the better mystery prize will win the overall challenge and the ten thousand dollars. Okay, what are we waiting for? Let's get to it. Yeah, let's go. Time for the mystery prize round. We have these chocolate hearts right here, and we have mini hammers where we'll hammer the heart, it'll break open, and there's a prize inside. We each fill each other up with random candies to try and get the other person out. We have to eat what's inside these chocolate hearts. Sarah, are you ready for the mystery round? I'm so ready, and I think I'm gonna win. In three, two, one, go. in here thinking that I wouldn't like it. Mm-hmm, it's extremely sour. How is that? It's so good. Really? Okay, let's see what's in here. Oh, we have the, the edible crayons. These look so weird. Does that look edible? Those look like they've been sitting in the factory for quite a bit of time. What's it taste like? It's definitely gum. Okay. Tastes like a crayon, actually. <gasps> like, that does not taste good. It's just chewy. Good job on my part. Mm. These are not good. Actually, these taste so bad. I gotta throw that out. Now we have the sushi. Look at that. It actually looks so real. Here we go. Mm. Oh. How is it? What is this? It's like spicy. <gasps> It's spicy. Ew, what is this? This is not good. Get that out. <laughs> oh, that's not good. You gotta eat that bottle, that, those mini bottles. Hey, let's try to like, try to bite off the top. Yeah, it's all edible, so you can eat it all. It's like juice. Yeah, how's it taste? I think it's for cold, those. but it kind of tastes like a watered down fruit punch. <laughs> Oh man, that was crazy. I, I was not expecting that to happen. It wasn't my favorite thing, because I think it just could have more flavor, but yeah, they're not that good. So now that we both ate both prizes in our mystery prize, now it's time for the voting round. Who made the best mystery surprise? Three, two, one, go. I gave mine a five because half of the items were really good and tasty because I love sour things. And the other one was more of a fail, even though like I didn't find much value in that wax. I have a zero because I could barely eat the sushi. It was spicy. This is not candy. And these crayons tasted like nothing. So that is a big old zero, zero, zero. That sounds like I just won. Yes, you heard it. Sarah won the $10,000 for trying the TikTok trendy candy. Oh, oh yeah! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, 
Whoa! Today we have a crazy, crazy challenge. That's right, and it involves the spy wagon, G wagon. Uh, if you couldn't already tell, it has to do with crushing things of the same color. Yeah, same color, green. Whoa, Whoa Grace, Woo you got my face wet. Oh, and pink. Oh, well, these things are very interesting. Oh. Oh yeah, comment whose outfit you think is the best. Since my color is pink, I get to choose from all these different items. We got some toothpaste, some like funky. Whoa, squishy, look at that! Oh, squishy, satisfying things. Fortnite llamas. That's kind of cool. Pinatas. That's cool. Hershey's kisses that are pink, which is super neat. And then some huge hatchimals. Oh, and John, don't forget. Oh. John. Sticky. Okay, I'm blue, so let's see what I have to pick from. I have this jumbo bouncy ball. I have some soap. That, I think, will be my winner. I also have a luggage. Oh, yeah, G-Wagon crushing that. I have some pumpkins with funky faces on them. And Xbox controller. Oh, yeah. I have a pretty good selection over here. I have lime green soda. Ooh. And then I have lime green soccer balls, tennis balls, jello, whoopee cushions, Orange juice and a boombox. So uh, let's line up. Let's see, Grace, who do you want to go first? So the rule to this challenge is that you have to pick super carefully because if your item doesn't crush, you get no point. If it crushes, you get a point. But it's up to you shares to comment down below and play along for who has the most satisfying crush. That will be the winner. Okay, well, Grace, let's get started. Who do you want to go first? Uh, let's see, I guess we can start from pink to green. Okay, John, that means you are up first. Well, I don't know what's inside these Fortnite pinatas, but they're huge and they look super epic, so I think I'm gonna start with this. Okay, Fortnite pinatas. Okay. Let's see how satisfying the crush is. Let's see it. Crushing Fortnite llamas, here we go in three, two, one. Go, go, go. Oh! Let's check out how it did. Whoa, look at that. That whoa. is totally ripped apart. What's inside? Whoa, wait, what is, whoa, confetti. Whoa, looks like John did crush it really well, but shares it's up to you to comment down below right now, one through 10, how oddly satisfying this was. Whoa, whoa, that scared me, that's mine. Well, I guess I'm up. Let me get started, let me go choose my item. John's Fortnite was good, but let's step it up a notch with soap. Here we go, let me hop in. Everyone, stand back, it's about to go crazy. Oh yeah, John, this is gonna be messy. Soap yeah. goes flying like wild. So, uh, start up, Grace, let's crush this thing. Woo! Okay, here we go. Here we go! Oh! Yeah. There it goes, there it goes, there it goes, there it goes. Woo! Whoa, the bushes moved! Oh my goodness! That was crazy, look at this. Whoa! Okay, that was Ooh. wild. Look how far it went, it even went all the way out to the street. Yeah. That's soap all the way out here. <laughs> well, that's one way to clean the driveway, Great. Shares, listen up. Let's crush this. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Excuse me, what was that? John, was that you? I heard some funny noises. That was so good. That was so good. <laughs> that was good, Shares. That was very satisfying. I would say that's a 10. These might be small, but I think they're gonna be super satisfying. Ready? All righty, let's do it. Three, two, one, go. Here we go. Oh, oh it broke. Keep going. Go over one more wheel. Go, John, go. Backwards. Back wheels. Backwards. Here we go. Oh. 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 Wait. That was really good. That was so Whoa. Cool. No way. Look at that. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Like that was a good one. You're catching up, John. Traveling to be the winner in three, two, one. <laughs> It didn't work. Why? Hang on, try it again. One more time. One more time. Wait, Grace, what do you use these? To do what? To crush? No, to put them in front of this and maybe it'll work. Uh, okay, try it. One there, just like that. Let's do it in three, two, one, go. Here we go, here we go. Good luck. <laughs> Nothing. No, I failed. You failed this one. <gasps> No point for me for this round. Let's crush this thing. Here we go. Watch out. Three, two, two one, go. Go, 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 go. <laughs> oh. Whoa. Put it back under. I'm going in reverse. Reset. Go backwards. Here we go. Attempt number go, 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 go. two. Whoa. Did it work? No. Oh. 
Hop on out. Failed. Looks like someone failed. Let's check. Uh, it doesn't look very crushed to me. Not really. You just open up the CD thing. Yeah. Uh, all right, that's no point for me. John, you're up. This right now, I've got something super epic. Oh, oh John. Hey, Where you. did that come from? Uh, your whoopee cushion. Yeah, sure. Right. What are you picking? I'm going to grab toothpaste. Watch out. This will be satisfying. Let's do it, John. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Oh. 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 Whoa, look at that. There's toothpaste all over now. Oh, yeah. Well, let's crush. I have no idea. Let's go, Grace. Let's do it. Three, two, one. Here we go. Let's find out. I don't know if it'll crush or not. Oh, oh. yep. Oh, yeah. That, that sounded, sounded cool. so good. That sounded really good. Bingo. Those pumpkins are destroyed. Oh, wait. She still got her lips on. Hello. Yeah. That was the most silent, least satisfying crush I've ever seen, Steven. No. I, I mean, they just mush. Nothing happened. Right, do what happens. Reverse. Here we go. Three, go, go, two, go, one. go. Go back a tiny bit more. You're right on it. Let's stop. Oh my gosh. They're just like squoosh. Oh, that's not a point for me. Today, I'm going to do TikTok school supply life hack. So I have all the tricks for school this year. So you better stay tuned because some of them are really cool and super, super helpful. And right in here, I just set up my school desk because I'm going to be online for school this year. So let's get started with TikTok number one. So back to school, TikTok life hack number one is the tangled headphone trick. So I'm sure a lot of you will be using headphones this year and oh, hate having it tangled headphones, well, this is a super easy trick for you. All you need is bubble gum, uh-huh, how crazy is that, and a sticker if you want to jazz up your little case. So the first step is take your bubble gum out of the container and um, if you want to snack a little bit, have some fun and snack a little bit. But now we have this empty container. Next, you take your headphones, you kind of like swirl them together to make a nice loop. Put the headphones in the container and then close it up. And if you want, you can take a cool sticker to put over top so it doesn't look like bubble gum. Put it right on top like that. And then our headphone case is all made. Check it out. Move them around, stick them in your backpack. Shake, 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 shake. Because that's what normally happens and that's why they get tangled. Take our little headphone case, it's kind of like AirPod case actually, but like a DIY version of them. Open up and look, they're not tangled at all. They're still in the nice little loop. This is perfect. <laughs> okay, and the next TikTok, this one is going to be fun. If you get bored in class, I have just the hack for you. All you need is a paper clip and a rubber band, and that is it. With those two simple things, you get a nice little slingshot. How cute. So let me show you how to make it. So you take your paper clip, you peel it open just like that, and then twist these completely over. So it kind of looks like a football goal post. And then easy last step is you just bend these over so then you have two loops on the side now You take your rubber band cut right there loop one end here tie it and do the same to the other side And then you have your nice little slingshot that's made out of all school supplies Of course we gotta test it out so say I have a little note or something I put it on the slingshot and here we go in three two one Woo! That went far. So the third back to school hack, say you get a little hungry in class, but you don't want any of your friends to know you're eating Pringles or else they'll ask for so many Pringles and then you don't get any for yourself. Well, I have just the hack for you. So in here are nice Pringles and ooh, I'm getting so hungry because I've been studying all day. Mm. But I don't want my friends to see I'm eating Pringles or else they'll steal them. All we gotta do is put the lid back on and then you take paper and wrap it around, take a little bit of glue, do a line down your paper just like that, seal it nice and tight, and then cut out a circle, put a little glue, and oh, smiley face, stick your circle on the bottom of your container, and then last step, take a zipper and do two lines down and up, put your zipper on top of the glue, 
just like this. So it looks like a pencil case, right? And it even unzips, which is the coolest part. But if you turn it this way and your friends are facing that way, you're getting a pencil out, right? But little do they know, you get a little snack out of your pencil case and they won't know you're snacking. Mm. Now this one is super cool. So say you're doing work at your desk and <gasps> Whoopsies. You spill water all over your desk. Oh, my iPhone's okay. All you need is a balloon to stop any spillage, specifically on your iPhone or your computer or laptop because we don't want to get water on those things. You cut the balloon right in half, right down the middle. You take this piece and put it over your lid just like that. So now let's test it out. I filled it up back with water and I put a straw in. Mm. Working, I'm thirsty, you know, reading some fan art. Like, whoopsies! <gasps> oh. But check it out no water comes out of your cup. And now my iPhone is safe this time, and my laptop is all water free. This is perfect. So the next back to school life hack is say you're not the best artist or you need a stencil of something. Well, all you need is three pencils, rubber bands, and you go like this. You put two pencils down like this, and then you take your third pencil and cross it over. You put one rubber band on there, and one rubber band on there, twist it all up, and you get a nice little stencil tool. Now we got our nice little stencil tool. So say I wanna do a nice drawing of the shared love hand. So I just follow the real photo that I wanna make, and the page below is what it will turn out to be. And check it out. Now we have the outline of the photo that I wanted to draw. And now all I gotta do is color this in any color I want, and I got the perfect art that I've been waiting to draw. This is a great tool for artwork or anything you wanna draw. I'm so glad I got this. Woo! The next TikTok hack. All you need is a piece of tape and a piece of gum. Mm, check this out. All you gotta do, take the tape out of the dispenser, just like that, and now open up the gum of your choice, whatever flavor you want. So you put the gum in right where the tape would go, move it around to adjust it, and check it out. Looks like tape on the outside, but you can trick your friends that, of course, pink tape is normal. Tear a little bit and mm, you're eating your tape. Perfect. This next back to school hack, say you're taking a test. Ooh, you're stressing out because oops, you forgot your calculator on test day. Well, check this out, the perfect hack. So say you're taking the square root of any number and you don't have your calculator, here is the trick. Always take the first two numbers, so one and four, and then you take the little number up here plus two, you add them together, write the sum right there. Then you take the last number that's at the end and subtract up top, which is 12, and 12 is your answer. This method works for any square root of any number. So there's your trick with no calculator to do the square root of any number. The next back to school hack is if you want to keep track of where you are in your reading book or your notebook or your math book, check this out. All you need is a square piece of paper and just for fun, some sticky notes and check this out. We're about to make a unicorn bookmark. Ooh, I can't wait because it's super cute. So take your square piece of paper, twist it like a diamond, take your bottom corner and meet it up to make a triangle, and then take your right corner, bring it up to the top corner, do the same side to the left side, just like that, and then open the two that you just made back up, take the top corner and bring it halfway down like that. Okay, this is getting tricky, but so worth it because we get a little unicorn out of it. Take your right corner and listen up. You want to take it, bend it, and slide it in and push it all the way down and do the same thing to the left side. And now we have our unicorn that we get to decorate. So I draw an eye with some eye lashes and then I'm going to put a little smiley face. So I took my sticky notes and I frayed the edges by just cutting some lines and then put them on her back by her head just like that. Oh yeah. Put it on your notebook or book or whatever just like that. Then close your book and check it out. You got a little unicorn Aww. bookmark. Oh yeah, look how cute. I love it.